I didn't observe a huge difference in passing power between the XC60's 316 horsepower T6 and 400 horsepower T8, but from a stop and at lower speed. The T8 provides instant acceleration and greater punch. Even though the T8 has a combined 84 more horsepower than the T6, its hybrid innards add more than 500 pounds of curb weight, lifting it to 4,599 pounds versus the T6's 4,045 pounds. What the plug-in hybrid gets you is an EPA-estimated 17 miles of electric operation on a full charge, followed by combined gas mileage of 26 miles per gallon. Both of those numbers are slightly lower than the 2018 XC90 T8. The XC60 T8's mileage rating also isn't dramatically better than the non-hybrids. The T5 gets an estimated 22 28 24 of a mile per gallon city slash highway slash combined, and the T6 is rated 21 27 23 of a mile per gallon. That's similar to other four cylinders in the class but with a little more punch from the Meteor 2.0 liter. If you're on the fence, the T8 plug-in hybrids available maximum $5,002 federal tax credit might help seal the deal. The XC60's ride quality, with its optional air suspension and adjustable firmness, recalls the XC90. Firm but not uncomfortable. Volvo didn't provide any standard suspension SUVs for us to drive.